My name is Greg Fox. I'm an equine veterinarian. I heard about the Piezo Wave technology through a broker, and he said, look, you got to consider this because this technology doesn't require you to send the probes in to be rebuilt every, I don't know, 20,000 clicks or something like that. I began to commit more and more time and effort to understand the extent to which shockwave therapy through the Piezo Wave could help manage horses that have sore backs sacroiliac pain and gluteal pain, lowest hanging fruit. It will help horses get through chronic sore muscles. Simple, easy to do, might take a few minutes, but it, you're gonna get a result. Uh, so the first thing I'm gonna do is demonstrate how I prepare a routine treatment for a horse with a sore back. The whole thing about the efficacy and um, of, of, of delivering this energy is a, is a coupling of the therapy source to the tissue. And so I moisten the area, and then I follow with a generous uh, delivery of, of gel. And this particular horse is in really good shape, and this, is, this, this general treatment for a horse's back and gluteal region is just meant to demonstrate a routine treatment. So now we've prepared the left side from the withers all the way back to the glutes. Switch back here. And the next thing is simple operation. This button here indicates how many shocks per second. It's a maximum of eight. And this one is the intensity of the, of the shock. So it goes from zero to 20. Um, typically I start with 10 and go up or down from there. The next decision is at what depth do I want to treat? Beauty of this system is it's, in, it's extremely precise in terms of the focusing of the treatment in terms of the depth. So you need to know your anatomy. So Typically in this area, I want to be treating approximately two inches, inch and a half to two inches, which is about 50, 40 to 50 millimeters. I'm going to choose 50. As you can see, I moistened the offset pad. All you need is a very small amount of gel. You get a nice film. You don't need to overdo it. And then this locking cuff goes on and you just want to make sure that if you you didn't put too much gel on and then it's hard to get a good seal here so now we're going to treat the horse so we put a little bit more on here so without him tranquilized I can identify trigger points along this merit acupuncture meridian it's really easy to find you don't have to use a lot of a lot of um, pressure and obviously he's tolerating this well, so I'm gonna go up in intensity. That's 15, 17. So you can see that even at full power, he's tolerating this really well. Now I'm just basically going along the typical meridian along the spine where horses typically get sore. And you can tell he, he can sense that. Along here, I use the 50 millimeter probe. Now when we get into this SI area and gluteal area, I'm gonna switch offsets and I'm gonna to go to a deeper probe. And this is one of the cool things about this system. It's by far and away the most powerful uh, system on the market for getting into these really um, important deep gluteal areas and SI areas. Really to quiet this down thoroughly, you'd probably want to put in around 500 clicks just in these areas. So you don't have to worry about, am I doing six, uh, 1,000 shocks, 2,000 shocks, 10,000 shocks. It's going to cost you as a practitioner the same amount. But you can see that that this has an immediate 
and reliable res results. And um, the fact that he's not tranquilized allows me as the practitioner to be super precise into where I'm uh, applying the energy source. If you follow these paths, you can't miss. Now, some horses, you'll, you'll get a lot of trigger points along here. Again, this is another major acupuncture meridian. And it's really common for me to spend time going down in this area. And, and that's basically how I treat a traditional back. You can treat the neck as well. Um, obviously, you're going to use a much more superficial offset, somewhere around 30 millimeters, uh, depending on where in the horse's neck you're going to treat. You can adjust the system to treat anything in the horse's body. You just have to know where the problem is, what the anatomy of the area is, and then figure out what offset pad best directs and focuses the treatment. Okay?